Hi guys, my name is Connor and today I'm going to be showing you how to configure OB scoreboard on vMix. Today I'm going to be showing you with soccer, but we also have these sports available right now. We're also in the process of developing for American football and baseball and cricket in the future as well, along with many more sports such as volleyball and a few more. So yeah, let's get started. So I'm going to select soccer. And then I'm going to say Man United versus Chelsea. And then I can add a description here as well if I want. I'm just going to click create. Next, I'm going to add this scoreboard. So you can see on the left, we've got the preview. And on the right, we've got the live stream. Here, you've got your layers. So you can choose how you would like it to animate or transition in or out so on entrance we can say slide right and on exit we can say slide left and then when you show or hide the overlay it will animate in so first we're going to select the teams i'm going to say man united i already have man united created so it appears here straight away next i'm going to say chelsea so you can actually manually put in chelsea here and select the colors manually or we can go in here and click create team Click new team, type Chelsea, click soccer, and then choose blue and white. And then you can upload a crest as well. I just don't have the Chelsea crest on my PC, so I'm going to click create. And you can see this, the crest will appear here as well if you do upload it. And then you can actually add your team formation in here if you want. For now, I'm just going to say player one is John Smith. You can also change numbers if you like. Click save. You can download a CSV here or an Excel file, and then you can manually type in the numbers there or copy and paste them from existing Excel sheets that you might have. And then you can upload them here and it will automatically fill out uh, your starting and your substitutions. So yeah, I'm gonna go back to the stream. And you can see here now, when you type in Chelsea, you can actually select it there and the teams will be filled out automatically. So next, I'm going to click update so it appears on my live stream. And then I'm going to click go live so that we can get a link to our stream. Next, you're going to click stream link to copy the link. You're going to go to vMix. Next, you're going to click add input. You're going to click web browser, paste your link here. You can leave the width as 1920 and the height as 1080 and click OK. Next, you can click the one here. So you add it as an overlay to your image one. And you can see it appears here on your live stream. Next, you're going to go back to OBS. You can start the clock. You can add a goal if you like, or a yellow or red card. And if you go back to vMix, you can see the update in real time. So yeah, that's pretty much it in terms of the scoreboard. You can also update the settings down here if you like. You can add added time, say, if you have two minutes at a time down here and click show on scoreboard and you can see that reflects on the scoreboard as well you can also add new overlays such as team formations or announcements so for this demo i'm going to show you um a team formation so let's say this one here for example you can see it automatically shows all of the names that were in the teams in the teams tab. So for now, we're going to hide the scoreboard and then we're going to click update and you can see it animates into our stream then. So after you've shown one team, you'll probably want to show the other team. So you can just click select team and click Chelsea and you can see on the left, you'll see it updating and on the right, it will update on the live stream. So again, the only player that I updated here was John Smith, which was the first player. And you can see that is displayed right here. If you want to go back and edit the teams, you can go into teams again, go into Chelsea, say Jane Smith, and then you can click save, go back to stream, and you can see it updates here pretty much instantly. You can change the style of this if you want. I don't know exactly what colors you want to choose, but yeah, if you update, Again, it will update it in real time. And then if you want to hide it again, you can hide and hide and then show our scoreboard again and click update. And again, that will all be reflected on your live stream. So yeah, if you have any questions um, about the setup here or any questions about OB scoreboard, feel free to reach out. If you have any feature requests, you're more than welcome to reach out to us as well. And we're happy to add as many features as we can to make the product as professional as possible. If you have any questions, again, reach out at info at obscoreboard.com or you can go to the homepage 
for the dashboard and click the profile button here and then there is a feedback form down here that you can fill out you can also join our discord community facebook instagram or follow us on tiktok as well thanks again have a good day